Day 13, our final day of Ignite, and today it's all about strength and cardio combined together. We're gonna to be doing eight brand new exercises, and we're gonna do four strength and four cardio, but we're gonna alternate them. So we do one strength, one cardio, and so on. On each exercise, it's gonna be 45 seconds of work with 15 seconds rest, and we're gonna complete four rounds in total. For your reference today, I'm gonna to be using just one dumbbell. It's gonna be an eight kg dumbbell. And for the body weight side of it, guys, the cardio bit, we don't need any weights at all. So when you're ready, let's do our final session together of Ignite. Let's warm up and let's go. Okay, let's warm up. Start off by kicking up behind, easing off the quads, left and right. A little happy bounce in the kick up, if you can, nice and energetic, ready for our day 13 strength and cardio session. Last couple. And then back to center. Let's go hip circles around to the right. Let's go for four. And then let's change and go four over to the left side. Excellent work. Okay, back to center now. Let's sweep the arms over, big circles. Open up the chest. Great work. And then back to center, roll those shoulders back and then down. So big, big circles, roll the shoulders back and down. Back and down, back and down. Let's go forward. And then release, let's shake it all out. Do a little jog on the spot. Let's get ready to do strength and cardio combined. We're starting with a low impact cardio move, which is a jack with a clap under the knees here. Okay, when you're ready guys, let's work out. Okay, we're gonna start with our first exercise, which is our cardio exercise. It is low impact today, but if you wanna make it high impact, you can do as well. Uh, but this doesn't require any equipment to start with. So we're gonna jack and we're gonna clap under each of our legs, right and left. So when you're ready, come follow along with me, guys. Let's go. Reach nice and tall, and then bring that leg up nice and high. Clap underneath each one. Great work. So 45 seconds of work today, 15 seconds rest on each of the eight exercises. Strength and cardio combined, but it is low impact cardio. Okay, so everything I'm showing you is gonna be low impact. If you want it to be high impact, you can add a bounce in, as I said. No problem at all. Last few. Good work. One more. Yes. Okay. Exercise one done. Now pick up your weight for your strength exercise. We're going to go into a plie squat. So turn the toes out. Nice and wide with a heel raise at the bottom. So we're going to go down, plie style, lift off, down and rise up. Nice and strong. So down, raise up and rise up. Push the knees out, lift up the heels, rise to the top, squeeze up the glutes. On these strength exercises, just take your time. There's no rush. Make sure the weight that you're using is heavy enough for you. So you get the gains. 10 more seconds to go. Great work, last one. And relax, brilliant. Okay, just pop that down safely somewhere. Next up, we're gonna do side punches, okay? So low impact, side punches. One, two, just pivot and twist and punch. When you're ready, come with me, let's go. Nice strong punches out to the side. This reminds me of when we did our kickboxing cardio 
video here on this channel. Absolutely love those. Really, really, really makes you feel good afterwards. So punch like a pro, left and right. 10 more seconds here. Great work guys, increasing that heart rate. Last two, one, and relax. Beautiful. Okay, next up we're gonna go onto the ground. We're gonna alternate the arms by doing one push up. So on your knees, one push up, and then one renegade. Then pass it to the other side, one push up, one renegade, let's go. Push up, renegade. Oh, this is heavy, this eight. <laughs> Roll it or push it to the other side. Nice. Keep it going for 10 more seconds. Nice work. One more, Woo. good work, okay. Keep that just out the way. This is gonna be single side only, so we're gonna step back and then we're gonna kick forward. All right, so when you're ready, come with me. Step back, kick. Step back and kick. So it's, it's not quite a lunge, yeah? So just a step back, kick forward. Imagine there's someone in front of you that you want to get. <laughs> and you just literally step back, foot push forward, back. If you want to increase the pace, we'll increase that heart rate as well. Just the right side kick only. 10 more seconds. <laughs> yes, let's go. Hardest kick you can possibly do. Last one. Yeah, <laughs> good work guys. All right, next up we need the weight. We're gonna do wood chops. So just one weight only. Working from the right, chopping to the left. Up, chop to the left, use your obliques. And your upper body as well. Nice and strong. Good work. Oh. Yes, 20 more seconds to go. Lovely work. It should be heavy. As we're chopping down that wood last time. One more. Woo. That was definitely a challenge for me with that eight, that's for sure. Okay guys, next up, we're gonna side squat. Then we're gonna duck. So we side squat, and then we duck, okay? So down, duck. Side squat, then duck in the middle. Side squat, duck in the middle. Side squat, duck. Yes. That's it. Get ducking and diving and squatting. <laughs> In the middle. Nice work. Ooh, this definitely raises your heart rate, eh? Without even having to jump. Good work. Last few. Duck. And relax. Wow, my heart rate is definitely elevated even though I'm not jumping. Okay, next up, a split leaning deadlift. So what we're gonna do is the weight in the opposite hand, tip forward and rise up. Just single side only. So your right leg's forward, your left leg is back, and then your weight is in your left. Split, leaning, deadlift, feel this 
in your hamstring and your glute on the right hand side. We're on exercise number eight of round one. Well done. It goes fast when you're having fun, doesn't it? Good work, 10 seconds left. Nice, last one. Oh, definitely felt that in my booty. <laughs> okay, so 30 seconds rest, guys, before we go into round two. Remember, we are doing jack and the clap under to start with, low impact cardio, or if you want to ramp it up, don't be afraid of like literally bouncing and lifting up your, your um, leg off the ground, okay? Anyway, I'm sticking to the low impact version for now. Arms up, let's go round two. I designed this session to be a low impact session, you see. <clears throat> but I just wanted to give an option for those of you who do want to jump and uh, increase that heart rate a little bit further. This is really low impact for people that don't want to jump or they can't jump. But you can still join in no matter what, you know. Okay, 15 seconds to go. And we've got that plie squat coming up next with the hill raise. Oh, I love that one, that's one of my favorites. Last few. Four, three, two, one. Woohoo! Smashed it again. You guys rock, seriously. Okay, legs out to the side, or feet, should I say, pointing out in plie style. Let's go down, lift off the heels, and rise up. Down, lift off, rise up. Good, take your time on this one, there's no rush. Next up, we're gonna have those side punches, all right? So nice and fierce with those punches. You're gonna be strong with those punches. There's no floppy punches, I want only tough ones, all right? Last few, good job. We got this, guys, got it. Relax. Pop your weight down. It's getting hot in here. <laughs> okay, so, on guard, pivot and twist, punch with the right, switch over to the left. Let's go. Good work. So remember I said nice, Fierce punches. We're gonna knock them out. We're not gonna do that by tapping. We have to go boom, bang. <laughs> oh boy. It releases that energy, doesn't it, when you punch. Good work. Last few seconds. Three, two, one. We smashed it, well done. Okay, so pushing up to the renegade, alternating, down on the ground. Okay, let's go, push up. Renegade right, switch it over, push up. Renegade left, switch it over. Renegade, oh. My eight is still heavy, guys. Of course it is. It's an eight. Oh. <laughs> On this exercise, it is anyway. All right, 15 seconds to go. Nice work. Let's go for one more. Why not? Oh, relax. Put them down a little bit softer than I did. Okay, we stepped back on the right this last time in front kicked with the right. Now let's go on the left. So, stepping back on the left, kicking with the left. 
Nice fierce kicks, okay? Not just tapping with kicking properly. Tap, kick. Okay. Yes. Let's go to the end. Get that cardio going. Make sure you balance as well. So stay focused. Good work. Last couple now. Two, one. Oh, well done. I found it a lot tougher to kick on my left, you know. I think that's because my left, no, my left is actually stronger. So yeah, anyway, I don't know. Something happened. <laughs> Wood chop from the left to the right. It's probably the balance, isn't it? That's what it was. Wood chop. Side squat and ducks are coming up next. And then that leaning split deadlift. And then we're halfway through the session nearly. Yes. Yes, we are. Ooh. 20 seconds to go. Great work, so far so good. We're smashing these sessions of Ignite so well. So proud of you. Last one. And rest. Good work, guys. Side squat, stuck in the middle. Side squat, as before. Are you ready? Keep that heart rate risen. Let's go. Side, duck, side, duck. Let's go, side. Oh, this is a real leg burner, isn't it? That's for sure. Ooh. That's the side duck in the middle. Good work. Leaning this split lunge is coming up next. You need to put your left leg forward on this one. We're just alternating the legs on each round. Let's go, guys. 10 more seconds. Oh, last one, push down, deep, back to center, relax, nice. Okay, so as we've got our left leg forward, we're gonna have the weight in the right, yeah? Split the position here, knees are nice and soft, left hands behind the back, let's tip forward, and then rise up. So go quite deep, deep range of motion, down, and rise up. Now push all of the weight into the left side. Breathe in. Out. Good work. We're going to get a 30 second rest after this before we go into round three. So stay strong. Last one, okay, release, let's go. Put it down, safely to the side. Grab a little drink and we'll get ready for round three. So we're halfway through the session now, people. Well done. Starting with our jack and the clap under. We're gonna reach up nice and tall. Get ready in position to bring the knees up. Clapping under, let's go. So reach nice and long, clap underneath and at the top, yeah? Under and over the top as well. Good work. Oh, I can feel a little click in my shoulder. That's what I was like, thinking, what's happening? <laughs> it's normal. My right shoulder clicks. It does it now and again. Ooh. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, nice, nice. Okay, 
Grab your weight for our strength exercise, the plie with the heel raise. All right, so feet are turned out. You're gonna squat down, heels rise, rise to the top. Let's go. I'm starting to sweat now. Who says you need cardio to make you sweat? You don't, actually. You can do weights. And weights and resistance training have real good benefits for men and women. Not just aesthetics, but you know, longevity. That's what I really do it for longevity. Feeling good, keeping nice and strong, you know. So important for the, for the length of life. Last few here, guys. The aesthetic side is the bonus, isn't it? One more. I'm really scared, okay. Pop it down. Now we're going into our, back into our punches. Did you punch hard enough on rounds one and two, ask yourself? If not, even harder now, let's go. Low impact, so stay on your feet, but punch hard. Make sure you relax the shoulders. And then punch out, so don't have your shoulders hunched up, is what I mean. Well done. Twist and turn with the waist. You got this. Brilliant work. 10 seconds to go. Five, four, three, two, one. Boom, yes. Round three done. We smashed it. Back to our lovely renegades in the push-up. Down on the ground and roll it to the other side. Let's go. Down. Rock and roll. Oh, I forgot to see the renegade. Sorry, guys. Yep, you spotted it. And renegade. Oh, I just rolled it to the other side without thinking. <laughs> At least I realized before the second rep. Let's go. We're we doing that right side kick next, okay? Stepping back and kicking. Five more seconds. Last one. When you go down on the ground and you face sort of forward and you're really hot and you're already sweating, it makes it even worse because then the sweat starts coming forward. Oh my goodness. Okay, which leg am I kicking with? Right, okay, step back, kick. That's why I sometimes laugh at myself because I always think I should have worn a headband and I never do. <laughs> However, I do when I'm teaching online on my live online lessons, so I should maybe take a note out of that book and bring my headbands with me to these ones. Kick nice and fierce. Well done. Last two. One. Okay, one more. <laughs> Always a bonus one there, isn't there? Wood chop, strength exercise from the right down to the left. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Okay, yes you are. Okay, good. <laughs> Let's go. Let's chop. 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 Chopping down that tree, aren't we? We need strength and power to do that. That's for sure. We've got that big axe and boom, chopping that tree down. Can't be weak, that's for sure. 20 seconds left here. Now, our squat and ducks coming up next. That little booty burn. Oh, last few chops, nearly there. Let's get it down. Oh, good work. Okay. 
into centre. Just catch your breath back. Sweating, but a good sweat. Let's go. Step to the side, duck in the centre, step to the other side, duck in the centre, over again. <laughs> centre. Squat and duck. What a great name for an exercise. I just made that up, really. I'm sure there is already this name out there. But, um, that's what I put on my board anyway today. Squat ducks. <laughs> Good work. 15 seconds to go. Nice. Four, three, two, one. Beautiful. Yes. Let's get that weight again. Step the right leg forward. Left leg is back. We've got one more round to go after this, guys. So stay nice and strong. Put your heels down, tip forward, and pull up with the right side of the leg at the back of the hammy. Breathe in and out. Breathe in, out. Breathe in and out. Good work. Keep that going all the way to the end. Give it a 30 second rest. Oh, well done. Let's have that well deserved 30 second rest. Before we go into our final round of this strength and cardio session that we have here, our final day of Ignite, day 13. Ooh. It's been a journey, this one. This one's actually a lot more uh, longer in terms of the length of the actual workout. So it's been a lot more intense for me to also film them for you, you know? Which is a good thing, not complaining. Let's clap under for the last time. So this workout here was a particular request from somebody that messaged me and where I put out a poll to ask what kind of workouts you like. And um, somebody said strength and cardio. So I replied back saying, absolutely, no problem. I will do more strength and cardio workouts for you. And then I thought to myself, do you know what? I'm gonna do that one today. Because I had a different agenda on plan, but because of the request, I decided to change my plans to fit in with your request. So I hope you're really enjoying this session and any other requests will soon to be filmed, guys. So I haven't forgotten anyone else, don't worry. Last one. So all the other requests, by the way, they are going to be implemented definitely in my next series that I'm filming, which is called Beachbody 2.0. So all the requests that come through are gonna be in Beachbody 2.0. As it's the last day of Ignite, there's no more days of Ignite. So any requests going forward can be for Beachbody 2.0, which I'm filming on location and it's gonna be super special. I cannot wait to go um, very, very soon, two weeks time. So I've got two weeks to plan anything, you know, that everyone's requested. Yeah, so. I'm super excited and I hope you can still stay with me and support me on this channel. It enables me to do stuff like that. Last two. And then one more for the last time, people. Down. Ooh, rise up, good. Okay, safely put that down. Side punches for the last time. Remember, nice, fierce punches. Pivoting with the waist. Your guard is up, but let's reach nice and long and punch. Good. Fist punches make it a little bit harder. Yes. Next up, we've got the push up to the renegade. So get ready. 20 more seconds here, though. Yes, we're rocking it, punching our way 
to the end of the session, finishing off strong, as we always do. Good work, last two. One more. And relax. Oh, I get that sweat from stopping flying from my eyes into my, I don't know, into my other eye, basically. <laughs> All right, push up to Renegade for the last time. Here we go. Renegade, then slip it over to the other side. Renegade. Push. Renegade. Oh. Getting fatigued, so it's getting a bit harder. This just shows you how real us trainers are. You know, we're not perfect, absolutely no way. We struggle or challenge ourselves like you do, you know? We're definitely by no means absolutely spot on for workouts each time. Try to be, of course. Last one. Oh. <laughs> but yeah, as you can see, <laughs> the struggle is real, yeah. <sighs> anyway, I'll stop waffling. We're gonna kick on the left. Step back and kick. Nice fierce kicks. Let's go. One thing I don't do, I don't know if other people do, is I don't stop my video and then start again later on. I carry on throughout the whole session. Um, I do the full workout with, without breaking it because that then it's real. It's not chopped up and edited on different days and things like that, different outfits. And I've seen that before. I'm not saying there's anything wrong with that, but what I mean is I'm participating in it with you. So you can see it doesn't matter about the sweat for me. Last one. I don't have to look super amazingly like I'm not sweating. I want to show you that I am a real person. I'm sweating with you. <laughs> All right, wood chops on the left for the last time. Let's go up, down, up. Up. And if I can't do it, then how can I give it to someone else? I've got to be able to practice what I preach, haven't I? Good, 25 seconds left. Side squat is up. It's coming up next and we've got one exercise, that leaning deadlift, and we're done. So there's light at the end of the tunnel, people. Good, last few. One more. Oh, well done. Beautiful work. Wow. All right, penultimate exercise, side squat ducks. Shall we do it for the last time? Yes, let's go. Duck in the middle. Left side. Duck in the middle. Right side. Good job. Twenty seconds. No, oh, twenty-five, sorry, seconds to go. Great work. 15 seconds left. Well, a leaning split on the left side coming up before we have a really, really nice cool down. And duck in the middle. Woo, relax. Well done, people. Okay. Weight is in the right. Left foot is forward. We're going to pull into that left side. Heels are facing down. Toes facing forward, let's hinge from the hips. Down, rise up. That's it, breathe out. In. Good work. really feel that in the glute here on that left side. Even if you put your hand on it, you know, 
Feel it under tension here, rising up, and obviously it's relaxed at the top. Last two. One more, guys. Slowly lift it up, back to centre, put it down safely. And a huge, huge, huge well done. Thank you so much for joining me on day 13 of Ignite, our final day of this series. Let's stretch. Don't forget, there are so many more videos and series that I have on this channel. And if you don't know already, guys, my name is Hannah. I'm a qualified personal trainer. I work one-to-one -one with people face-to-face -face in my area. I also am producing lots of content three times a week for you guys here on YouTube, which takes up half of my time, by the way. Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays currently. Um, I'm posting out new videos to you and each of the sessions that we do are linked to a series. So uh, previous to this one, we did Beachbody 1.0. This is Ignite. We have no gym, no problem. Fit in 15, a fitness series, which is Christmas themed, but you can do the workouts at any time. Um, what else have I got? A pick and mix. So there's shorter workouts and you can also pick and mix the body parts that you want to train. So once again, another great combination way to train. And um, the Fit in 15 is just purely 15 minute workouts. Um, every single one of them are different, but they're all 15 minutes. Um, and I have Empower as well. Um, Empower is um, a mix of strength and cardio. Um, have a look on the playlists anyway, and you'll find lots of variety. Let me know what your favorite ones are, or mix and match if you want. All right, my um, mission is to give you the best value and going forward, I'm constantly innovating ideas so that I can give you lots of variety. And I also ask you to, to comment so that I can know what you guys um, want from me to, to, to work out with, whether it be strength, cardio, mixture of both, glutes, abs, you know, pop your requests in and I'll do it. I promise you. I will. Just like I promised the lady or the gentleman on this um, session today, sorry, I couldn't remember who it was. Because sometimes the YouTube names don't come up and I'm not sure if it's male or female. <laughs> um, but if you let me know your name, that'd be good. <laughs> All right, guys, have a great rest of your day. Thank you so much for joining me. I will see you in the new series, Beachbody 2.0. Have a great one.